Did you know that the cost of housing in the US rose over 15% between 2021 and 2022 with housing costs skyrocketing many have saved for years, only to realize that they no longer can afford the home of their dreams but all of the homes in America are unaffordable today on Explore the Globe. We're going to look at the 10 cheapest states to buy a house in 2023. Number 10. Alabama. Remember when I said that the cost of housing has increased by over 15%. If you're looking in Alabama you'll likely be pleasantly surprised to learn that. Houses here have not increased by 15% in fact according to Redfin they only increased about 2.4% between December 2021 and December 2022 and the median home price in Alabama according to home buyers is only about $142,000. Given that the median household income in the state is approximately $66,000 this means that the income to mortgage ratio in Alabama is only 12.2% of the context the most expensive state to buy a home. Hawaii has an income to mortgage rate of 35% which means that while those in Alabama only spend about 12% of their income on their mortgages those in Hawaii are spending almost triple that amount. Number 9. Oklahoma. Did you know that as of 2021 Oklahoma was ranked number 3 on Sophie's list of the states with the lowest cost of living this analysis estimated that it only costs about $34,533 per year to live in Oklahoma furthermore they estimated that per capita housing and utilities only cost about $6,152 per year this means that not only is it cheap to live in Oklahoma but you may even be able to buy a home the median home price in this state is only $136,800 and with a median household income of $67,000 this means that the income to mortgage ratio of Oklahomans is only 11.64% with a monthly mortgage payments of about $650. Number 8. Nebraska. Next up on our list is our first state in the Midwest which is no surprise. Because the Midwestern United States has some of the most affordable housing in the country that's certainly true of Nebraska while the median home price of $155,000 is slightly higher than the other states. We've looked at so far the median household income is also slightly higher, leading to a lower overall income to mortgage ratio of 11.19% that means if you're bringing in the median household income of 79 thousand dollars you're only spending about 740 of your income on your mortgage each month but nebraska isn't just good for cheap housing if you have a family and are looking to move the corn husker state should be a strong contender on your list as wallet hub named it the eighth best state in the country to raise a family nebraska also doesn't have a shortage of employment opportunities with one of the lowest unemployment rates in the country and fortune 500 companies like berkshire hathaway and union pacific Number 7. Indiana. Indiana has the second lowest income to mortgage ratio on our list according to data from home buyer with a median home price of about $141,000, median household income of $73,000 and a mortgage to income ratio of only 11 means that you'll only be spending about $673 each month on your mortgage compared to Hawaii. Indiana also has options for both city and country dwellers if you're someone Who's looking for rural quiet living you'll find it here and if you're looking to live in a city you'll find that in places like Fort Wayne, Evansville or Indianapolis which has over 900,000 people. Number 6. North Dakota. North Dakota is a great place to move if you're looking not only for affordable housing but also to raise a family it recently ranked the fourth best state to raise a family in the US according to that study I mentioned by Wallet Hub and with the cost of housing here significantly below that of the national median if you move here you can rest easy knowing that you're not blowing all of your income on your mortgage most people in north dakota spend about 12.27 percent of their income on their mortgage which runs about 921 dollars per month for a median home of 193 thousand dollars so what's it like to live here well north dakota is particularly well suited for outdoorsy types as it's home to about 8% of the country's national parks. Like Theodore Roosevelt National Park. Number 5. Mississippi. If you're on the hunt to move to an affordable state with a slower pace of life Mississippi may be a great option for you Mississippi not only has the lowest cost of living in the entire country according to world population review but it has cheap housing too that's right its housing is estimated to 
be about 34% more affordable than elsewhere in the country with a median home price of $119,000 being a homeowner may no longer be a dream but a reality if you decide to move here and though the median household income in Mississippi is lower than many other states it still only has an income to mortgage ratio of 11.3%. Number 4. Kansas. At approximately $151,000 the median home value in Kansas is significantly lower than the national median in fact residents here only spend about 11.19 of their income on their mortgage if you're considering moving to this state you'll be happy to know that in addition to having cheap housing kansas also has one of the lowest costs of living in the entire country according to rent cafe kansas is 14 cheaper than elsewhere in the united states with housing 29 percent lower than other states if you decide to move here you'll not only benefit from a low cost of living and low home prices but also an unemployment rate of only 2.9 percent and unlike some other states Kansas's economy actually grew by 2.6% in Q2 of 2022 due to industries like agriculture and manufacturing. Number 3. Ohio. If you're looking to buy a home in Ohio you'll be paying about $145,000 for it, with monthly mortgage payments of just under $700 and if you're earning Ohio's median salary that's only 11 of your income making this one of the cheapest states to buy a home while some of the other states on this list are more for Country dwelling types Ohio is great for those looking for city living as major. Cities like Cincinnati, Columbus, Cleveland and Dayton are all relatively affordable. Number 2. Michigan. Michigan is one of the most affordable states in the country with the cost of. Living here is estimated to be 10% below the national average and within. That housing is about 23% lower than the national rate a median price. House in Michigan is about $154,000 with monthly mortgage payments. Estimated at approximately $735 this is only 11.7% of the median. Household income in Michigan making buying here is relatively doable and there's plenty to do in Michigan if you decide to make the move if you settle. Near Lake Michigan for instance you can take advantage of its 1,500 miles off the coastline for boating or swimming or given the state's history within auto industry, you can enjoy one of Michigan's many museums. Number 1. Iowa. Number one on our list is Iowa ranked as one of the most affordable places to buy. A house on several lists the median home price here is $147,800 well that's not the lowest price in the country Iowa has the lowest income to mortgage ratio out of any other state in fact Iowans are only spending 10.6% of their income on their mortgages which make home ownership in Iowa a reality for many in fact while Nationwide about 65% of people own versus rent in Iowa that number is. 72% of this is even the case in Iowa cities where properties tend to be more expensive. Get ready for incredible adventures and enjoy cashback on flights, accommodations, car rentals, tours, and more. Explore the world while saving big. Link in the description. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more travel tips and inspiration.